Welcome to Easy Meaty Meals. I'm Emily C. Bundrung, and today I'm going to show you how to make a simple, not your mama's meatloaf. Before we get started, make sure to click subscribe and the bell so you can get notified when I release new videos every Wednesday and Friday. All it takes is six ingredients. I've got six pounds of beautiful grass-fed ground beef from my half cow, four eggs, two medium onions chopped, a little bit of thyme, some Primal Kitchen barbecue sauce, which I love, and some Primal Kitchen unsweetened ketchup. Also, some Redmond Real Salt. Preheat your oven to 350 degrees. The first thing we're gonna do is saute the onions. I've got some lard that I've kept from when I cooked some bacon. You can also use avocado oil, coconut oil, tallow as well. Now we're just going to add the onions. Onions smell so good, they're getting soft. Another quick tip, if you're cooking anything in an enameled cast iron pot or pan, make sure you're using a wooden spoon or something with silicone so it doesn't scratch your, uh, your pot or pan. So the onions are now soft and we're going to put them in, oh this pot's heavy, <laughs> we're going to put them in to the meat, dump all of that in there. Now I'm just going to mix it in because the onions are a little hot still, so I'm going to cool them off by mixing it with the cold meat. I'm actually just going to use my hands. <laughs> Let's actually get this off this pan. Yeah, that onion's hot. <laughs> Next, we're going to add the four eggs. One, two, three, the egg is going to help bind the meat together. Next, I'm going to add two teaspoons of Redmond Real Salt. You can use any unrefined salt as well. Hell, let's just do three. It will add a lot of flavor and bring out the beef and onion taste. I just did a fourth one. <laughs> did I just do three or four? <laughs> I don't even know. Three to four teaspoons. Then we're going to do a teaspoon and a half of thyme. Now you're just going to use your hand, it's so much easier. We're going to mix it all together. Now I'm going to add the ketchup. Get out of there. <laughs> Might need to use the end of the spoon. I would say about half the bottle of the ketchup, so it would be about Five, five ounces of ketchup. What I like about this recipe is that there's no breadcrumbs. You don't need it. It's just added carbs. So we are taking that out of this recipe. So now I'm going to make three loaves out of these six pounds of ground beef. Evenly divide it. Now we're going to form the loaves. So have a look. We're going to make rectangular cubes. Wait, what's a, a cube is squared? What would rectangular be? <laughs> what, how do, what's a 3D rectangle? I like making sure that they're even, so it cooks evenly. So make sure one side isn't higher than the other or thinner than the other. So you got to mold it a little bit. Now we're going to add the barbecue sauce right on top. And the trick here is to let it cover the whole surface area of the meatloaf. Just make sure you're getting the sides as well, you might need to use a little more. 
Now we're gonna pop them in the oven. So it's been 45 minutes and I pulled the meatloaf out of the oven. Now we are going to taste it and I've got two lovely taste testers that are gonna try the meatloaf. We've got Andy's story and Cody's story. <laughs> <laughs> howdy, howdy. It's not the most beautiful cut, but you see here, as you can see, I like my meat a little bit pink. Starving, it's time to eat. Okay, there's yours. All right. You can come closer. I can't walk in here and smell such good food and not. And then I want you guys to tell me what it. you think. Okay. Go ahead. I'm ready. Mmm. I like it. Oh yeah. Mmm. Bomb. Perfect amount of salt. The ketchup really gives it moisture. The eggs keep it together. Mmm. What do you think, Andy? Mm. As the on-site carnivore, I give it two thumbs up. Mmm. And Cody. Tasty. <laughs> How about you? Are you happy we have food for like the rest of the week or maybe a few days? <laughs> I see one day, two day, maybe three days. <laughs> that is true actually with what's going on right now. We're, we're, we're home all day, so we've been eating all of our meals, everything at home, which is awesome. All right, so that was my easy meatloaf recipe. If you have any questions or comments, leave them in the comment section below and don't forget to click subscribe. Peace.